hey there. As many of my friends and all of my family know, um, I am pregnant. I'm with child. I decided that I wanted to document my pregnancy a little bit better. I know that I make videos and I vlog, but I've decided I want to do it more regularly. So I'm going to start vlogging hopefully every single day. That's my goal and also writing on my blog about it. This is the third baby and the third time has been quite an interesting one. It's not, it hasn't been as straightforward as the other two. There have been some bumps in the road, but all in all, like so happy, so thankful, everything's good. Baby's healthy, all is well. As, as most of you know, I am a little bit older this time, this pregnancy. I'm actually considered to be, what do they call me? Like a geriatric pregnancy, which is, I think, very offensive. Come on, man. Women are having babies well into their 50s, aren't they? <laughs> all I know is that I know a lot of women that are around my age or older having babies and we're all good. We're good. We can still change diaper. Taking it back all the way to finding out I was pregnant. Cute old video. Okay, I'm sorry. I just can't wait. I can't wait any longer. I've had a hunch, and but I haven't really felt like I am. But I'm not going to lie. There is a huge possibility that... There could be double lines on this little jobber right here. So I can't wait. I mean, it's a little bit early, but I can't wait. It's happening right now. Right now, it's happening. Or it's not, I don't know. But you know what I mean, it's happening right now. Oh my gosh. It is Thursday, September 1st, 2016. Oh my goodness, this is so fancy pants these days. It's been a little while since I've used one of these. It's all digital and stuff. Okay, now we just have to wait. Look at this thing, I mean, I'm not holding it level. Sorry about my dirty bathroom. Got a lot going on right now. None of which is cleaning my bathroom. I know that's gross, but come on, hourglass. How long you gotta flash? My cuticles look really dry right now. Just got my nails in. Maybe I need something to cover that screen just so it's more, so there's more suspense. I need to cover up something. <laughs> this is just so the suspense will kill him. He first kind of has to peel away this piece of paper and then he'll reveal a random picture of Kanye, which is indicating and trying to mean nothing. It's just random. I want to give you an anniversary gift. Now sit down. Oh. <laughs> Thank you. Yours is On coming the eve at, of our... Yours is coming at a later time. On the eve of our five-year anniversary. Hold on. Oh, peel away the white first. <laughs> no way! <laughs> <laughs> you want to see what I got, Peter, for this anniversary? Uh, open it up. No, you're not. Really? How do you think I got that one? You think I bought it off of eBay? Ew! Wait, is there pee on it? <laughs> no, it's covered. So shortly after I revealed to Peter that I was with child and we rejoiced, I started to get really sick. At about week six, oh man, I started feeling that nausea like a mother. And it was like almost debilitating. It was morning, afternoon, tea time, dinner, all day, er day sickness. Went to a private doctor, he did a blood test, pulled me back in, told me my HCG levels were abnormally high. So that started this whole 
journey into finding out why my HCG levels were so high. Because they were so high, I was really sick. But this guy, like, I guess, I, I'm not used to this tactic here, but I guess it's sort of a common tactic to kind of just lay it all out there. To give, to give the woman or the patient, like, every possibility, even if it's bad. All the worst case scenarios, because that's what he did. He told me he thought I had a molar pregnancy, which I'd never heard of before. Went to the private obstetrician, got an ultrasound, saw the baby, saw the heartbeat, heard the heartbeat, was like crying profusely because I was so relieved, but then she tells me, yes, you have a baby, it looks normal, but if, if you have a partial molar pregnancy, the baby will die. Oh, I mean, devastating. That is not what I wanted to hear. Long story short, it all turned out fine. They don't know why the HCG levels were so high. Everything seems normal gonna vlog every day about my journey sometimes it will be completely about my pregnancy but other times it will not and of course I'll be throwing in the kind of videos I do on a regular basis just kind of like the everyday vlogging or activities that we're doing sort of my personal video journal and a way to share the experience if anyone out there is experiencing pregnancy right now or these types of things then um, it might be kind of interesting to you. Yes, maybe not. I don't know. But in any case, it's a great video journal for me and my family, and I'm excited to do this. All right! Pregnancy, baby! Yeah! Let's do this, baby! Oh, yeah!